it's sort of like sailing on a motorboat. So you have the silence, complete silence. When the motor is on, you don't actually hear it. And you get to experience more of what the CEO has to, has to offer, which is the wind and the waves, which is uh, very, very good. You can go at full speed and actually have a conversation with people on board, which is new on a motorboat. Uh, and you also uh, have no smell, and that's a, a very big concern for people, especially in the yachting industry. They're tired of the diesel smell or the, or the gasoline smell, and uh, here you can actually smell what the nature has to offer in the ocean. The yachting industry is waking up to this for very simple reasons, and uh, that's because most of the beautiful islands that they were able to visit in the past are now banning uh, thermic engines and gasoline. So if they want to continue and visit these, uh, these uh, islands and these nice places, uh, they will have to own an electric tender to go to these places. And that's uh, very famous places like the fjord in, Nor in Norway or the Keys in Florida. Uh, and more and more, they, they will look for that type of solutions to do that. It is a quite fast-moving technology because uh, now everybody's talking about the environment, so um, the awareness of the polluted oceans is big, so uh, everybody's trying to help out some way to do something, and uh, this is the future. Today there's not really any charging points for the uh, boat industry, but all the harbors have electricity in the harbor. So uh, we've been touring around all Europe with this boat, and at the moment we haven't had any problems charging the boats in the harbors we've been at. Yachting is, is obviously creating a carbon footprint, but we have to bear in mind that it's all relative. There are five and a half thousand boats on the water. Um, probably half of those are actually actively used by their owners. So uh, the imprint, although yes, it, 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 is, uh, it can be deemed pollution, is, is still very modest compared to other industries. The industry is looking at uh, greener technologies. Um, hybrid propulsion is obviously a very pertinent topic within the industry and is gathering traction among many owners. But I, I believe that this is more to do with owners who are savvy to, uh, to the, the concept of efficiency, and that's efficiency within the amount of fuel that they use, the, uh, the range of their vessel, but crucially, 
the level of comfort that it affords them and their families and that that manifests itself mainly in uh, minimizing noise and vibration and that's really where the industry is focused.